Hi guys, welcome to Oxbridge Study Secrets. In this video series, we're going to talk about the study tools, mind management techniques and lifestyle hacks that top students from Cambridge, Oxford and other world-class universities and schools use to help them get the best possible grades with the least amount of stress. So you might be asking, who is this video series actually for? Well, it's for any student at any level who wants to learn the most effective way to ace their exams while living in a balanced way. These tools and techniques are ones that I go and teach when I give talks at Cambridge University and other top schools in the area, but they're also the ones that I teach some 13 and 14 year old private clients. They can be learned by anyone who's willing to apply them. So whether you're doing GCSEs, A-levels, IB, SATs, university modules, they will be something here valuable for you. Now, another question you might be asking is, who am I to be making these videos? Well, for those of you who don't know me from Instagram, for example, I'm Cam, Cam Taj. I was fortunate enough to go to Cambridge where I studied chemical engineering via first year natural sciences. And I ended up actually specializing in manufacturing engineering where I got a first class degree in my undergraduates and I got a master's degree of merit as well. So after I graduated, I went into a city job doing management consulting, but I actually left shortly after, maybe about two and a half years ago now, to pursue my passion, which really cheesy, it's helping others. It's doing my utmost to add value to the world in the way that I can. So now I'm a performance coach, I'm a speaker, and I'm the author of The Ultimate Guide to Exam Success. This book that I'm so proud of, that some of the content here is hopefully going to inform this series, Oxbridge Study Secrets. So at the moment, I work with high potential students and young professionals as well through one-to-one -one sessions, talks and workshops, where I work on improving their performance, achieving their goals, and improving their overall sense of well-being and satisfaction with their lives. But let's get back to Oxbridge Study Secrets. Because the reason why I created this series and why I wrote my book, The Ultimate Guide to Exam Success, is because I wasn't always a top student. You know, the story is, is that three weeks before I actually got my Cambridge offer, I'd actually failed my further maths mock exams with a score of 28%. That is worse than a fail. And funnily enough, when I got my offer, Cambridge told me they wanted an A star in further maths specifically. Guys, I worked so hard over the next few months to get the grade. And even then, I just scraped it. I'm so grateful for that. But the truth is that in Cambridge, when I went there, I felt like a complete imposter when I talked to other students there doing natural sciences who told me they found further maths easy. I ended up getting the lowest mark in my year that year in natural sciences. I scraped a 2-2 and I actually got an email from my director of studies saying that I'd come 558th out of 619 students, dangerously close to the bottom, in his words. Now here's the thing, in my second year I resolved to commit myself to getting that 2-1, but I actually ended up missing that by 0.2%. I got 59.8%. And I'll be honest, it was one of the most disappointing moments for me to have come so close, but to have missed the mark. Now, in my third year, I was actually coming off a really rough time in that second year summer and I went through some mental health challenges. It got to the point where I was contemplating leaving Cambridge entirely, just putting this all aside. But when I came through that experience and I decided I was going to stick around, around January time I made a commitment to myself that I'd rather fail on my own terms, studying in my way, living a balanced lifestyle, doing things intelligently, not just rushing around trying to do what others are doing. And I ended up not just getting a 2-1 that year, I actually ended up getting that first class. And it's these tools that I used to turn my failures into success, this mindset that took me from wanting to drop out to not giving up. These are the ones that I want to share with you in this series. These are the ones that I hope I'll not only be able to contribute, but I'm also gonna get other top students from Oxford to contribute to these videos too. So let's talk about what kind of stuff we'll actually be covering in these videos. So we're gonna be looking at study tools, like how to make the perf perfect revision notes, what's the most effective way to learn, what are the most effective revision strategies for each subject, creating the perfect study environment, finding your perfect time to study. 
We're also going to cover time management topics like how to create study plans that you actually keep to, how to beat procrastination once and for all, how to optimise your productivity when you study, and how to manage your time so that you have all the time to do the things that you want to do while still honouring the things that you feel you have to do. We're going to do mind management techniques, like creating motivation that actually lasts, managing stress and anxiety, overcoming our fear of failure, making goals that actually inspire us instead of those that terrify us, how to feel less pressure from our parents, from our peers and ourselves, why our self-talk matters and how we can manage it, letting go of our self-doubt and creating confidence, and performing at our best on the actual day of exams and interviews, so we can do all our preparation justice. And on top of that, we might even talk about some lifestyle hacks, things that can help us optimise our studying, like fitting exercise into our schedules, even for beginners, how our eating habits and hydration can affect the way we study, why sleep is actually so important to getting great grades and how we can get more good quality sleep, and creating support groups, academic and personal, that help us to become the best version of ourselves, the ones that allow us to create boundaries so that the wrong people don't negatively influence us. In the end, guys, this video series is yours. That means that I want you to choose the topics that we cover that are most relevant to you. So please just comment below, drop me a DM on Instagram, email me, message me on Facebook, whatever it is, with whatever you'd like me to cover. We're going to do our best with these videos to keep them between three and eight minutes in length, which is just the right amount of time to share a concept in detail without everyone getting bored. But that's it for this introduction video. Let's make Oxbridge Study Secrets one of the most helpful video series to have ever graced YouTube. Mighty ask, I know, but let's make it happen. Guys, keep growing, keep striving, and keep shining.